early rifle seasons in Colorado are just beginning. Let's go check in with my brother Ike as he glasses for a big buck. Well folks, welcome to Southern Colorado. Down here uh, hunting mule deer again this year. Should be a good hunt. We found these, these bucks here on the first morning. Just some decent little four point bucks. One's got a little kicker. Um, great deer, but obviously not what we're looking for. So come along with me as we hunt the gray ghosts of Southern Colorado. strategy worked. I think the deer just aren't quite to that level we're looking for. You know, right. that hard horn, he's not quite 180 probably. He's got really good fronts, but just, you know, not great backs. The three point is a three point. He'd be a fantastic deer, don't you think? If you had four, plenty more, right? Yeah. First, this is the first night of the hunt, so. Yeah. Well, let's keep looking. Ike is patiently combing the country, thoroughly looking for something special to put his tag on. Every day that passes by means a few more bucks have stripped their velvet, making the hunting just that much tougher. You know, that's a great buck. He's just not very wide. He's got everything else. He's got the great forks. He's got decent main beams. He's got back forks. He's got everything. He's just only about 22 inches wide. We saw another buck on this other, on the other side of this ridge. Let's see if we can tear apart this oak brush over here and see if we can't find that other buck. Mike and Johnny think they have the big buck spotted, but they want to get a closer look just to make sure it's the buck they spotted early the first morning of the hunt. Mike and Johnny are struggling to keep up with the buck as he quickly feeds through the burn and back to his bedding area with his nose into the wind.
Late that afternoon, Ike sets up on the spot where he thinks the buck bedded and soon catches a glimpse of movement as the buck feeds his way back out of his bedding area and into the creek bottom. I think he's down. Is he down? I think he's down. Yeah, he's down. He's done kicking. Oof. 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 All right. Let's go check him out. Well, I was able to uh, find this buck a couple nights ago, but the storm rolled in and it started raining, and it took us a couple days to find him again. We found him late yesterday morning. He's a great buck. He's got some really cool features on him. Just a typical Southern Colorado nice deer. And remember, fair chase is the only way to hunt and take trophy big game. We'll see you right here next week on Eastman's Hunting TV.